Their life now revolves around reliving memories of happier days and hoping to get reunited with their loved ones. Manipur is in the national limelight right now. The Prime Minister is being briefed daily about its conditions while fresh cases of arson and violence continue. The Home Minister is working to get both Mete and Kuki to talking table. But on ground, people of both communities have literally forgotten their past history of harmonious living. They have their daggers out to target each other in any and every way. It's midnight here in Imphal. Probably entire nation is having a good and sound sleep. All I see the women from the Meitei community in the valley, in the near, in the capital, are sitting here on the road. The Myra Paibi, these women who have been the torch bearer for the women's rights, are yet again on the field, and here they are protecting their village, their family, their children from, the, as they call, anti-social elements again narco terrorism and especially because of the enmity that has triggered in last three months between Kuki and Maitei they accuse that probably the other community people can mix up with them and trigger violence this is a volcanic situation where you see the women in the midnight guarding their territory the bordering of their village and this is not only the young women but also the elderly the senior citizens from the family member instead of taking rest they are now yet again has become not just torch bearer but also guard of their villages their territories their areas manipur ka halat to bahut bigad gaya hai hum log hum log ghar mein reh nahi pa rahe hain hum logon ko ghar mein sone ke bajaye apne गांव की रक्षा के लिए ताकि कोई हमारे घर न जला दे गोली न चला दे इसलिए हम लोगों को रात को गांव की निगरानी करना पड़ रहा है तो सी थे अगर वो लोग खुशी खुशी आएंगे तो फिर हम लोग एक साथ रहने के लिए तैयार है रेडी है शांति से एंड विद दैट द फायर बर्न्स कांगले पार्क एंड मणिपुर बिकम्स अ ब्लडी प्लॉट इन द नॉर्थ ईस्ट पीस प्रोसेस